Because he turns them to body. Time for take two of Mega Sword. We're doing Mega Sword, by the way. Um. Sound enthused! Now! Konami, does that company still exist? Uh, okay, that's an interesting story about Konami. Go on then. Well, during the development of Mega Sword 5, the most recent Mega Sword game has come out, uh, Konami kind of went batshit insane, to coin the business term, and basically shut down production of every single one of their games in development. So there was a new Silent Hill game, done with Hideo Kojima, director of this game, and um, what's his face who does Pacific Rim. Yeah, what I'm Yes, him. They were doing the Silent Hill game, they were cancelled. Uh, and now they, yeah, there, there was a, there was a trailer out or a demo out for it, but they got pulled when Konami went, no, nope, not making games anymore. So no, they just don't make games anymore. They just went, fuck it, to everyone. All their franchises, like Metal Gear, Castlevania, Silent Hill, and probably lots of others. Now they make nothing but pachinko machines, just gambling machines in Japan. Seriously, yeah. Which is why Metal Gear Solid 5 is only half the games there, because half of the game is when we're not making anymore. Done. Launch a nuclear weapon. That's, where the, that's where the hashtag fuck Konami came from. You'll have two right. mission objectives. First, you're gonna um, rescue DARPA chief Donald Anderson and the Baker, yeah. arms tech, Kenneth Baker. Kenneth Baker! Both are being held you wanna say who Kenneth or who you think Kenneth Baker is? I know who so, Kenneth Baker is because he's still alive. Whether or not the terrorists have the ability to make a nuclear to find the right tab now. Stop yes, I have to get his title because he's in the House of Lords. He's Baron Baker of Dorking. Dorking. Stop it. I'm like, Baron Baker, that sounds awesome. Of what? Dorking. Sounds like a badass now. Well, like the code name's Decoy Octopus. That's not a badass name. So, for anyone who doesn't, isn't, who's never heard, Kenneth Baker is a real person. Not related to this. Yeah, they are different people. Not... Radically the Duke of Dorking was suddenly in Alaska. Baron Baker of Dorking. Baron Baker of Dorking. Yeah, the bad 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 terrorists in Alaska. Still so in the house. Of Fox um, involved in this Baron activity. Uh, Kenneth Baker Psycho was the education secretary. Uh, a number of years Sniper Wolf. A beautiful and hey, Margaret Thatcher. Decoy Octopus. Anyone I'll instruct you by code after you reach your target. Image, he was a slug. Anyone going with me? As usual, <laughs> okay. this is a one-man infiltration mission. Weapons and equipment, OSP. A slimy. Yes. This is a top-secret black op. Don't expect any official support. Swimming around. So back in the, in the Alaskan water, which has got to be fucking cold. Oh, yeah, it's like... Freezing. Oh, and he's got an honorary doctor of education from Plymouth University. Lucky him. We're back to Mel gets hot before we go off. Right, yes, yeah, of course. Come on, to have... Moving he, away from the real. You didn't, you didn't mention the other thing you recognise from this. Hmm? You didn't mention the other thing you. What, the, what was it? I can't the remember. voice of the Colonel. Oh, yes, the voice of the Colonel is. Um... It's Uncle Max, I think yes. his name is. It's Max and Ben 10. It's a one man choir. Or, well, I'm not sure if that's a man or a woman. If that high pitch is either a woman or a boy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, some people can like, hit surprisingly high notes. <laughs> God, look at this graphic, man. In the day where even 3D at the time looks like shit. That is what they make it. I don't know if I'm saying that, nevertheless. You know, you're smoking a cigarette. A lot of gas coming out of your mouth. I'm standing here with my arms crossed like that. You've got very long hair. Very luscious long hair, I think you'll find. L'Oreal. He's worth it. Unlike Snake. 
Let's go a mullet later on. Phone calls. There we go. More games need in game phones to call people with. We get calls up. This is Snake. Phoenix Rye had one, didn't it? Looks like the elevator in the back is the only way out. Just out. as I expected. I have to take the elevator to the surface, but make no, sure nobody sees you. you. Well, you need to I am talking. I know you are. The frequency is like one four zero point eight five. When you want to use the codec, now, push the select button. We need to contact, contact you. The codec will beep. When you hear that okay, noise, Carol, press okay, the select, select button. button. Anyway. The codec's receiver directly stimulates the small bones. Wouldn't that throw you off balance? No one but you will be able to hear it. Probably. Got like stop with his phone. Okay. Just I'm ready over. to go. Okay. Ow, my leg. Wouldn't <laughs> that to be done now? Why not? Is the bone was well, your ear bones vibrate anyway? You hear? I don't know which part of the ear keeps you balanced. I don't know if you have an ear infection, or you bugged up ear that really ends. It's inner ear, I think. It really messes your balance up. Anyway, if I can mount this on into the stealth game, the uh, epic title that wasn't the PS1, which did quite an amazing thing considering what it's on. Yeah, it's true. It's generic. It tries to have custom design, that thing. It's a stealth game, the aim is not to be seen by the enemies because, hmm. Well, you try to fight with this combat system. It's not easy. Snake, there's an elevator there you can take up to the ground. You'll just have to wait for the elevator to come I mean, down. We never did come down again. Two days later, somewhere. he's still waiting. <laughs> Colonel well, said not to move. It. The Colonel said not to move. I obey my orders. No one here. Me, but I can't come so yeah, now you're just waiting for the other man. While you get the credits, your favourite credits at the beginning. Yeah, I like credits at the beginning. More things than credits. <laughs> okay. So watch a film go, don't care, no credits at the beginning, I'm leaving. I'm just gone. I just don't care anymore. Um, no films do that anymore. Films Wait. don't. No. You have to begin, otherwise you lose your audience. It's very uh, instant gratification, modern day audience. If I'm not immediately interested, I don't care. Something yep. needs to blow up in the first minute. That's why Michael Bay keeps making money. Somehow. I still haven't understood why. I don't either. Okay, do it. I'm mean, gonna move you on stupid, but I'm not that stupid. Can I just climb up to the elevator shaft? Probably not. <laughs> also, they will hear your footsteps as you run. Ooh. So if you should run up behind them, they'll go, hey, who's running behind me? So it is proper stealth, isn't it? Yeah. On the PS1. Had more stealth pants than most modern day stealth game. Mm. They will follow your footprints in the snow. They don't hear you between floors though, if you're on the upper floor. Right. Yeah, there are limitations to it. Oh, thank god the elevator's coming down. That would flash a light every time I say, like, WARNING! ELEVATOR COMING DOWN! Let's go right here and blend in. You know, I'm not going to let come. When you send them in something white, to blend them, I mean, you are in Alaska. Yeah, they're but wearing depends. white. They're wearing white. You know what I mean? All right. On the outside, it would work for you. I mean, the nature good. of it that would only work if you were doing external sort. If you're working on the inside, where he is now, you want grays. An email goes on three where you can change your camouflage on a whim. That would work. If you can do, you change your what you're wearing somehow on your face paint. So you got the lift. From the lift, now we're gonna undress ethically and get our scuba gear off. Because we couldn't have taken it off earlier. In fact, leaving it in the elevator means someone's gonna come across it eventually. Yeah. Look at that bandana. And that lack of a face. 
the mask. I'm very pointy ears. He's an elf. <laughs> Look at the level of detail on those girders. Oh my god, man. And they thought he was going to definition on the joke. Um, Tactical espionage action. Espionage and action kind of probably think go. Love it. Action you expect hardcore explosions. Which there are plenty of explosions in there. And espionage, espionage is, is the subtlety and infiltration. Which you also do. It's amazing. Better than episode 5, which is tactical espionage operations. You run your own private arm. Open all the Good one now. Be dramatic. And you're lucky no one moves up behind you, Steve, without having a phone call. It's yeah, like, I, that's very true. Hey, Steve, with the guy who having a phone call, what does he drop in? That's just rude. Oh, He's right there, he came in the back. The age hasn't slowed you down one bit. How's that sneaking suit working out? I'm nice and dry, but it's a little hard to move. Bear with it. It's designed to prevent hypothermia. This is Alaska, you know. Take it easy. I'm grateful. If it weren't for your suit and your shot, I would have turned into a popsicle out there. An anti-freezing peptide snake. All of the genome soldiers in this exercise are using it. I see. I'm relieved to hear that. Already <laughs> tested, huh? Lot. By the way, how's the diversionary operation going? Two F-16s just took off from Galena and are headed your way. The terrorist radar should have already picked them up. Damn, down there, radar. Helicopter blades. It's a helicopter. It's a Heinz D. D. Yes, it is. I just said that. What's a Russian yeah, gunship okay. doing here? Yeah, you see, I'm better than you. I have yes, no mate. idea, but it looks like our little diversion. You don't sure you can't shoot down an F-16 in the helicopter. Best chance to uh, Considering the speed jets go, you are certainly unlikely to shoot. He never surprised me, does it? Like Jesus Christ. Do we have skill over there? I mean, if you've got air to air missiles, possibly, but yeah, you're right, speed for one thing. How many will be? Jets are much more maneuverable than helicopters. It is. Actually, oddly enough, a helicopter only gets a jet. Jets are more likely to take it out, but it's not a guarantee. Particularly if the helicopter can, alright, it's gonna sound weird, surprise the jets. <laughs> Wait, run quietly. There are only no, I mean, as in the jets are moving line. quick. You've got mm. to hurry. Jets can't slow down. Wow. You must be crazy to fly behind in this kind of weather. No, they put the end. Who's that? <laughs> oh, sorry. I haven't introduced you two yet. This is Mei Ling. She was assigned to us as a... It sounds like an uncle sort of matchmaking a little bit. That doesn't mean more, sorry. Code I haven't introduced well you yet, have I? Well, this is so quick. <laughs> Contact her if you have any questions about either of them. <laughs> nice to meet you, Snake. It's an honor to speak to a, a living legend like yourself. What's wrong? Awkward pause. Nothing. Which is always business by a little world class head. designer of military. How you know when you let your question so someone thinks right and you they just don't, they just give you ellipses you, you go, Well you're hiding something because your ellipses no, gave you away. Yeah. Well I know I won't be bored for the next eighteen hours. Come on. I can't believe I'm being hit on by the famous solid snake. Quit but, flirting. Uh, I'm surprised. Yeah, you're a very banter. frank for a train killer. That's not banter, like it's flirting. In Mario Sword 3, your medic spends more time delving movie trivia on you. Every time you say, you like, Snake, have you ever no, seen it's, this it's film? Snake, he goes, no. no. And you get this long tirade about right the film. The it's Snake, I don't want to see flirting. Oh, and that voice, you get many women. Be careful, Snake. The genome soldiers have highly developed sense of hearing and vision due to their gene therapy. Make sure you don't let them see you. First, I want you to infiltrate the disposal site and look for the DARPA chief. The DARPA chief was injected with the same Mei Ling, your voice changed. nanomachines as you. Well, you speaking of that, in the remake and later on the game, she does lose the slightly racially insensitive about terrorists. Yeah, and has it's just an American accent. She grew up in America, it doesn't really make sense. You would have the no, yeah, stereotypical, right. also annoying with Naomi Lee's German Jackson. But if you're discovered by an enemy, you won't be able to use it. Yes, it gets jammed it's easily. I'm afraid. It's still yes. alpha. It's all made it jammed very easily. Quite suspiciously. You won't be able to use it in an area with strong harmonic resonance, so be careful. We'll be monitoring your movements by radar, so contact us by codec anytime you want. Got it. I'm, I'm always lonely. lonely. Seriously, Snake, uh, we're here to back you up. So call if you need some information or advice. 
I'm also in charge of your mission data. Contact me if you want me to record your current status. My frequency hey, is one got her number. point nine six. Yeah. It's a dedicated he frequency for saving data. Don't forget it. Remember, except for your banana. You should have said Pluto. You need to arm yourself Naked. with whatever uh -huh. weapons you can find. Like, oh, I remember. It. First, I'm strip searched by Dr. Naomi here, and then all my weapons are taken away. Imagine yourself put in that position. Well, if you make it back in one piece, maybe I'll let you do a strip search on me. I'll hold you to that, Doctor. By the way, sorry. Wait, flashing! I did manage to smuggle out my oh, smoke. Calm down. How did you do that? Computer to my stomach. No romance. Thanks to the shot you gave me. That's None whatsoever. None. Cigarettes. How are those going to help you? You never know. There's no romance in games. You never wanted the soft, lonely. soft, smooth taste of Marlboro. <laughs> New world, man. It, 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 com it, it compliments the ass you man. Get Snake, you doing a commercial? Get Shut up! We have to get all my make, make, make by military pay than what it used way, to be. But there's too he has to do commercials. By the enemy. I can't just knock on the door. Knock, and ask knock. Them in. That might work. You never know, Snake. Yeah. Left, on the one right. on the day it will work. Armed with five, five, so yeah, six, I'm the uh, Jana. Why you got guns on you? You never know. Those rats. America, goddammit. Those rats can get. Don. You just put you just second amendment. What about the air duct near the door? <laughs> Janet is allowed to be armed. <laughs> the, it is the right of all there citizens be to bear arms. Floor. Yeah, but, like it's like clue like sting a missile launch just so we get later. Oh what well, automatic weapons are allowed? I can't like, see. How far they go? Anti tank weapons are remote control missile launcher. And and how far they can push it on the state legislation. You are our only second. hope. They prevent all out nuclear war. Which is based upon my very mouth, I guess, again. Stopping all out nuclear war. Spotlights, they all spot you. That's why they're called spotlights. And they try to lure you out there with knife in the middle. Sounds oddly surprised by having something that's military based. You think there would be surveillance cameras? Yeah. Damn them! My weakness! <laughs> He loaded us to not think when they were putting those crates there. Or loader, I don't know what I saw. Do, 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 do. That guy there is actually sleeping standing up. The genome soldiers can sleep standing up. Well, they will wake up if it's you walking in and still hit you. Got my SOCOM, my gun. Always be armed. Always. Second Amendment. Yeah, that. <laughs> <coughs> oh, he's coughing. I'm losing reaction to the Second Amendment right now. We're not American. <laughs> We're not allowed to bear arms. But we can bear legs. <laughs> no one likes British legs, they're not attractive. British, hey. British men legs. Men legs. Men legs. Men legs. New brand of from I don't know what that would be a brand of. Somehow I imagine it to be a mint of some kind. <coughs> In length. Brand new. Coming this September. So coming this December, the brand new mint everyone's talking about. Men legs. Men legs. Guaranteed to put the hands everywhere, but your legs. Did guys go by. Thank god they all have a present. Patrols. I'll cover this thing very useful during this blaster. Um. That Uncle. base must have some kind of ventilation yeah, system to circulate the air. Top secret military cover operation. Oh, it's around there somewhere. What, ma'am? They uh, must need no, a little power to run the base. I'm working. There's probably a diesel generator somewhere. And since generating electricity requires oxygen, there must be exhaust openings for that, too. You're not going to believe this, but they shot down the F-16s we were using as a diversion. You got more than one now? Then we got a message from Liquid. He said, yeah, that helicopter is like that again. Or liquid, they launched the nuke. Pilot. Snake, 
Hurry up and get in there. That hind will be coming back soon. All right, you take a hard job. Oh, heavens. One safe place in the world. We'll bump into Alan Jensen's world. Who doesn't get phone calls every 10 minutes? Snake, this is McDonald Miller. It's been a long time. Master, what are you doing here? I quit being a drill instructor, so I moved out here for some peace When we think and quiet, peace and quiet, we I'm think Alaska. Just like you. Once in a while, I still help train the Alaskan scouts. You should like eat their friends one day. Huh? You know, military stuff. Campbell told me about the situation here. I thought I might be of some use. There's no one I'd rather have in a foxhole than you. Well, I know lots about survival in a harsh environment. I've lived in Alaska longer than you. Where'd you live? In the middle of nowhere, like hunting bears for food. about the flora or fauna out here, my frequency is 141.80. Master Miller. Important cool information about the flora over there. An old friend of Snake. Old mentor Snake. He helps you out in Metal Gear 2. The game That's so good. He retired. He lived in Alaska. Trained the Alaskan scouts. He helped to eat their friends. First floor basement. What about the vent shaft cleaning? They just opened the vent covers. I'm about to start spraying for rats. First floor basement ventilation shaft. Shut those covers as soon as they're done spraying. Also, keep your eye on that woman in the cell. Don't get careless. Now. Wait, she is a woman. Woman in the cell? Well, got those two there. Well, they're done back to position us. Very thoughtful of them. I'm not sure where he moved to adventure. Did we? Clawing, right? Clawing. That's kind of what I'm God's sake. Press the action what button mother? to drop down. Yeah. That's <laughs> what I'm saying. You're on the action button. I think he's laying on top of the ogre there. I'm levitating in there. And... It's the core muscle. <laughs> what? <laughs> Use the elevator no. to change Use floors. the elevator to change the floors. Who would have guessed? You can take down I thought they were just there for show. Try to find it. You stupid man. How did you become a colonel? Shaft grenades. Jamming things. Including your own radar jam. This door becomes lost later, so the trials to get in here. Well it's like probably <coughs> What's some thermal bubbles? They'll be useful later. Jump in that and drive that around. That's espionage. Luigi's mm -hmm. going that way. Elevator. Oh, thank God it was here.
actually faster than the major mode screen in Metal Gear. This is on the PS1. Oh, for God's sake! I know. Look at the radar. It's picking up the DARPA chief. He's the green dot. Hurry and rescue him. Why is he green? Look at the yeah. radar. Just said this. Up the DARPA chief. He's the green <laughs> dot. Hurry and care. rescue him. Haha, <laughs> memory cards. Back in the day. When you needed memory cards. <sighs> Come on, Snake, you can do it. I have to do it. It's my job. I'm paid. Allegedly.